became my friends, I decided to work on some Jimmy Buffett songs today uh, for my video lessons. Um, just roll through a few more. Uh, Let's take a look at Come Monday. Um, I'll just tell you guys the chord sequence for you who already know how to play chords and stuff and just want to um, quick know the chords to the song and how they fit with the lyrics. And then I'll go back and you know teach how to play every chord <coughs> in the playlist somewhere else. Um, so you all probably know A already. And that is going to be the first chord uh, to the verse. Yeah, this is the part where he says... Heading out to San Francisco. Then we have a D. So, so far we have A, D. Headed out to San Francisco. Next we're going to have E. For the Labor Day weekend show. And then back to A. We have A, D, E, A. Headed out to San Francisco. For the Labor Day weekend show. And then for the second line of the verse, it's pretty much the same. We have A. I got my hush puppies on D. And then E. I guess I never was meant for glitter. Rock and roll. So we'll do that all again. Remember, A, D, E, A. Headed out to San Francisco. For the Labor Day weekend show. I got my hush puppies on. I guess I never was meant for glitter, rock and roll. Uh, and you can play the A like this, or like this, or like this. Doesn't matter um, how you do it. So next we have this part where he says, uh, And honey, I didn't know I'd be missing you so. And what we have there is B minor. Honey, I to D didn't know E that I'd be missing you so. And you can throw an E7 in there. I'm not sure if he does that or not. I don't think he does. But anyway, that I'd be missing you so. Again, our, our chords for that section. Honey, B minor, D, I didn't know E that I'd be missing you so. And we'll do the uh, chorus to this in the second section of the playlist. Um, and then maybe the third section, I'll show you how to play the chords. But uh, so here's the whole thing. Um, so we're going to go. Headed out to San Francisco for the Labor Day weekend show. I got my hush puppies on. I guess I never was meant for glitter, rock and roll. And honey, I didn't know. That I'd be missing you so come Monday. And then we'll go to the chorus. So that's our first segment. And I'll also show you the strum and things like that in uh, in another segment of the verse. And I'm, I'm sure there's some finger picking too. But we'll worry about that again later in the playlist. Here's our chorus for Come Monday by Jimmy Buffett. Um, I'm just going to go through and play the chords along with the lyrics real quick and show you that way for those of you who already know how to play the chords. And I'll also include a segment in this playlist of how to play the various chords that he uh, uses for the um, song as well. Okay. So the whole thing starts with a D. Um, it goes, come Monday to A. It'll be all right. And then we do the same thing again. D, come Monday. And then we go to an E. I'll be holding you tight. Now, there's two ways to do this next section, a hard way and an easy way. I'm going to show you the easier way. It goes from A. I spent four lonely days. And then we have C sharp minor up here on the fourth fret. In a brown L.A. haze. That's a D haze. And then we have D, and I just want you, then E back by my side. So if you want to get a pencil and write down the chord sequence, um, it is A, I'm sorry, come Monday, it starts on D, it'll be all right, A, come Monday, D, I'll be holding you tight, E, and then we have A, I spent four lonely days. C sharp minor, 
in a brown LA haze D E and then D I just want you back E by my side to A and now I'll put a little strum to it and I'll show you how to play the strum in a in a later video something like this come Monday it'll be all right come Monday I'll be holding you tight. I spent four lonely days in a brown LA haze, and I just want you back by my side. And like I said, if you don't know how to play any of these chords, uh, just find a segment in the playlist that features that. Okay, I almost forgot. Here's a little twist on the uh, chords to the bridge or chords to the chorus, rather, the part that goes, I spent four lonely days in a brown LA haze, and I just want you back by my side. In a previous segment, we learned how to do it that way. Every so often, to kind of walk the bass, I spent four lonely days in a brown LA haze, and I just want you back by my side. I'll do this little thing. Um, I played this stuff live for many, many years, probably 20 years out there on the scene. Um, so uh, it's cover tunes. So I've, I've worked out little arrangements. Um, here, this one, uh, you go from A, I spent four lonely days, to a uh, E over a G sharp. That kind of walks the bass. So it's something like this. I spent four lonely days. And you could also even walk the bass underneath the C sharp minor, which sounds great too. I spent four lonely days and then do an F sharp minor in a brown LA haze and then you just finish it off the way you would otherwise so uh, every so often I would go A to E over G sharp and then maybe walk the F uh, minor or even minor 7 and then E and then D E A and that was probably confusing I'll go over it one a little slower so we have A I spent four lonely days to an E over G sharp or a uh, C minor over G sharp or even C7 that can uh, sound kind of interesting then F minor 7 or F minor your choice and then E and then D E A one more time I spent four lonely days in a brown and I just want you back by my side and that doesn't sound exactly like it it's just kind of a mishmash to try to get the notes that the bass player and things were playing on the recording anyway that's an option okay this is the bridge to come Monday by Jimmy Buffett I'm just going to show it to you quickly with the words and we'll go over how to play the chords later in a video in this playlist um, it starts on a B um, major 7 where he says uh, I can't help it honey and then he goes to an E so we have I can't help it honey and then we have B major 7 again that much a part of me now to E and then B major 7 again remember that night in Montana E and then D when you said there'd be no room for doubt and it's D to E so we'll go over that again here we have B major 7 I can't help it honey to E that much a part of you now to E. See some sunlight's starting to creep in here. Uh, what is it about 8:48 in the morning? Sun's coming up. Anyway, B major seven. Remember that night in Montana to E. And then we have D. When we said there'd be no room for doubt. And then we throw a little strum in. I can't help it, honey. That much a part of me now. Remember that night in Montana, we said there'd be no room for doubt. And then there's a little instrumental after that part of the song. Okay, so there we go. Next up, uh, I'll cover the strum.
this is a nice easy strum you can uh, use when you kind of play Come Monday by Jimmy Buffett um, if you're kind of singing it along a campfire out on the beach or something. Um, <clears throat> very basic, like this. Headed up to San Francisco for the Labor Day weekend show, etc. And what I'm doing here, um, if you look down here in the lower left, I, I'm just going down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up. Up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. And a little hint when you strum. Um, a good idea is to just kind of have your hand kind of moving in this pendulum kind of motion like this. And just kind of scraping the strings. And then you choose when to pick uh, notes and when to just kind of skip over them. So in this particular case, I'd be doing down, down, up. So I'd miss that. Down. See here, I missed... Um, this upstroke down real miss down up so that's what we really have down miss up down. down miss down up down miss down up down miss down up and then we just have an up down up so we'd kind of miss again and then have up down up so we have And then you just kind of switch it in the chords. Each chord change gets a strum. For example, down, down, up, miss, up, down, up, down, down, up, miss, up, down, up, down, down, up, miss, up, down, up, down. And then you would just throw the words in. Headed up to San Francisco For the Labor Day weekend show I got my hush puppies on I guess I never was meant for theater Rock and roll So there's a nice easy strum And in the final segment of the video here I'll just show you some chords Okay, and our final segment of uh, Come Monday uh, lesson Is just to quick show you how to play the chords That I went over so quickly In the first one Assuming that people may have known how to play chords already Um First there's the A, uh, very quickly you're going to have your first finger over the 4th uh, string, 3rd string, and 2nd string on the 2nd fret. And for this one, if you look down in the lower left, I'm not strumming the lowest string. This is muted or just not strummed. I'm actually just picking from uh, the A string straight down, like that. Another way you can play this is 1, 2, and 3. That seems to be a little bit easier for a beginner sometimes. It's first finger, fourth, second fret, fourth string, second, uh, third, sec second, third string, second fret, and again, uh, three, um, third finger, second fret, second string. And you have just one five notes. Next to the D, it's pretty easy. And online, you can find charts for all these. Um, second fret, second string. Uh, no, second fret, first string, second finger. Man, where's my brain this morning? And then uh, first finger, second fret, third string, and third finger, uh, third fret, second string. And it looks like this. And for this one, we're only strumming four strings. If you look down in the middle of the left, I'm starting on this. So we have just four strings. And then our E. Um, for this one, we have our first finger, second fret, first finger, first fret, third string, third finger, second fret, fourth string, and second finger, second fret, fifth string. So, and for this one, we actually strum all the strings on the guitar. And then it goes back to A. Uh, so that's the four chords that you need to know for most of the verse. Um, the other kind of oddball one here is C sharp minor. I'll move over a bit so you can see it better. Um, for this one, we actually bar, called barring, all these strings with our first finger. So our first finger is covering uh, these five strings right here. Um, a lot of times in the videos, it looks like I'm actually like on top of the fret. I'm not. What's happening here, if I can give you a thing, is my the flesh of my finger is kind of right on the edge. So this is um, this little bit here is hanging over, but you don't really see it in the video. But trust me, I'm not on top of the fret. So anyway, and what we're going to do here is bring your second finger to the fifth fret, second string, uh, pinky 
sixth fret, third string, and third finger, <laughs> sixth fret, fourth string. So we have this. And that is our C sharp minor. Another one, another last one is B major seven that he uses. Um, that's down here on the second fret. Again, a bar chord. So really this finger has to hit, if you look down here in the lower left, my fifth string and first string like that. And these three, it doesn't matter, but of course we have to bar it. Um, our second, third, and pinky fingers for B major seven are gonna be a uh, second finger Third fret, um, third string. Here comes my little dog clicking its fingernails across the uh, hardwood floor. You probably just hear this clickety clack thing. Hi, Peanut. Her name is Peanut. A brown uh, dachshund. That would be a wiener dog, for those of you who don't know what a dachshund is. Anywho, um, second finger, third fret, uh, Third string, pinky, fourth fret, second string, and um, third finger, fourth fret, fourth string. And then, so we have those three like that, and then we're going to bar the whole guitar. So there's pretty much all the chords you need to know for Come Monday, and we'll just conclude the lesson with that.